Well, it's making a name for itself as the first and only craft light cider made in the U.S. Yulee's Light Cider was founded in Portland with the goal of cutting calories, which is how most people's New Year's resolutions are founded. The goal of cutting calories, we had Vitaly Paley earlier talking about adding some vegetables into your life. You guys can help add some fruit into your life, right? With Yulee's Cider. So we have Scott Gallagher, the president and co-founder, and Eva Marco Trigiano. I say your name right? Yeah, thanks. <laughs> An employee with Yulee's. So tell me about this cider, 99 calories in one can? Correct, yeah. Typical cider has about 180, 280 calories or more and it tends to be kind of sweet. There's some wonderful ciders out there, some wonderful craft ciders. A lot of my colleagues make wonderful stuff. However, I like stuff that's less sweet, a little more dry, and as I get older, a little less calories, especially entering the new year. So mm -hmm. 99 calories per can. You can have a whole six pack and fewer calories in a Big Mac. Wow. And probably more fun than if you just ate a Big Mac. Absolutely, always more fun. <laughs> <laughs> so how many different types of cider do you guys make? We currently have two different ciders. We have our Citra that's made with Citra hops. And we have our dry. Both are made with uh, Northwest apples, all locally sourced, no preservatives, no artificial flavorings. This is 4% alcohol, 4.2% alcohol. So you can have a couple cans, not feel too woozy. Mm -hmm. uh, or you can have a whole six pack and have a lot of fun. Just enjoy the taste of it, That's right? That's right, just the taste of it. That's excellent. And this is all made in Washington, headquartered in Portland, but made in Washington? Mm -hmm. Correct. That's and cool. we are currently, you can purchase at New Seasons, Whole Foods, Fred Meyers, and soon we'll be in Safeways and Albertsons too. Now, how did you guys actually, what was the process to figure out, because I'm sure the other people making cider aren't like, we would want it to be almost 300 <laughs> calories per can because we like our calories. How did you guys get it to be 99? It took us uh, about eight months, uh, more money than I wanted to spend, and 26 recipes to finally get it right. But, uh, wow. Yeah. So it took a while, but it, it was worth it. Lots of taste testing. Lots of, and lots of taste <laughs> testing. So you were lots glad the time. alcohol content wasn't like 10% because you had to do a lot of taste testing. We had a lot of volunteers. <laughs> That's excellent. Now, do you have a favorite of these? I love the Citra. It's okay. made with uh, Citra hops from the Yakima Valley. It has a nice grapefruit, kind of lemony zest flavor to it. The dry is very uh, upfront apple, easy to go down. Both of them are very quaffable, easy to drink. Now, should we have you pour them out, see what they look like, and have a taste? Absolutely. We have one of our producers, Louisa, of course, gladly coming. You know, we did invite more producers to come have a taste. They're all like, we got to leave. Like, fine, <laughs> we'll have all the fun for New Year's here on Live at 7. So that is the... This is the dry, the, the original. Dry. Okay. And it's only 5 grams, 99 calories per 12-ounce can. Now, Eva, while Louisa tastes the dry one, so you help pour at different events and stuff? I do. Do, do people have a favorite one? Uh, you know, it goes about 50-50. Some people really love the original dry and some people love the Citra Hops. When you're talking to people at the festival, are they surprised that it's only 99 calories? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And they're like, we'll come have more tastes from you. Yeah. Make themselves feel better. They tend not to believe it until they try it or they're very suspect. And then mm -hmm. once they try it, so far they like it. Okay, Lucy, did you try it yet? Yes, I did. What did you think? Very, very flavorful. That's exactly yeah. what I was going to say. It doesn't mm -hmm. taste like 99 calories. Yeah. I will say, really it kind of, it tastes like, it doesn't taste super alcohol mm -hmm. flavor-y. Those are words. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, it tastes a lot like you're drinking just like sparkling apple cider, mm -hmm. which is excellent because then it tastes delicious. Yeah, it can be dangerous that way. It goes down very easily. <laughs> Exactly. We only have one more minute left in the segment, so we can't drink all of it. Now, how did you guys come up with the name Yulis? Yulis is short for Ulysses. Uh, so if you think about the story of cider, about 100 years ago, cider was very popular in America, and it fell out of favor, especially around Prohibition. It was replaced by beer. So now cider's coming back, so it's been on sort of an odyssey. Ulysses, if you think about the Greek myth, if he was also on an odyssey. He was on a, an adventure, and it took him a long time to get home eventually. So we kind of make that comparison between the two. Okay. Now if people want to go on an odyssey and try Yuli's Cider, where can they find it? They can find it at New Seasons, Whole Foods, Fred Meyers, and pretty soon Safeways and Albertsons. Oh, excellent. Now you mentioned beer there. Are you guys hoping someday you could have a 99 calorie beer too? Or are you going to stick with cider? I think we're going to stick with cider. <laughs> of course, you can check it out at yuliescider.com, U-L-E-E. Scider.com. Thank you guys. You're very Cheers. welcome. Cheers. Now let's try, oh, yeah. try some citra too. Oh yeah, you might as well pour the citra. Okay, pour that one so we have a beautiful beauty shot. Oh. <laughs> and uh, you get the can. <laughs> Thank you. Perfect. <laughs> Zach Cam, did you get some? <laughs>
He's had yes. the whole six pack. All right, that's good. <laughs> there we go. It's all yours. I'll die.